We have a new mission for you. You're going back to Bolivia. Despite our success breaking up the Santa Blanca drug cartel, the country is in a state of chaos, and we have a new complication. A data leak has compromised CIA operations, and the government-backed UNIDAD forces have called in a mercenary cadre called Los Extranjeros to eradicate all American agents. The problem is, the mercs are more interested in picking up where the drug lords left off. They're looking to fill the void left by the cartel and destroy any hope Bolivia still has. Make no mistake, Los Extranjeros are well-armed, well-equipped, and ruthless. Your objectives. Locate and extract any surviving CIA assets in Bolivia, neutralize all threats, and gather intel so we can expose what's going on down there to the world. We're inserting you across the border by Hilo at O Dark 30. Roger, Ghost Dazzle. This is Sierra 9 Transit. No tracking detected at this time. Nobody knows we're here. We're getting to AO. Confirm transit. Good hunting. Ghost Dazzle. Ghost Team, listen up. Two minutes to the LZ. Get your gear together. Sam Launch! Where the hell did that come from? Did anyone else make it down? Just us. Uh, some welcome. Sierra 9, this is Ghost Dash. Any call signs confirmed status. Do you read? Please respond. SATCOM feed is being jammed. And they knocked down the helo with a heat seeker. Pretty high tech stuff for some jungle backwater. So, what's our play? As long as one of us is alive. The mission is still a go. Take it easy, man. You're safe. I didn't think I was gonna make it out of there alive. <sighs> Hand to God. I, I thank you. You saved my life. It's what we do. Sit tight. We'll find a way to extract you. No! No! Uh. I'm not going anywhere. Uh. Look, I may not be an operator like you guys, but I'm dialed in down here. I want to help. The other members of the CIA prep team, they're friends of mine, and I want to find out what happened to them. Just let me do something. Well, what can you tell me about the situation with Los Exonjeros? Plenty. They're taking over where the Santa Blanca cartel left off. They installed three key officers, each one controlling a different region. Before it all went to shit, I was tracking possible intel locations. Look, if you and your guys can track down enough info on these pricks, then I can use my local contacts to pinpoint target opportunities, and that'll lead to the officers themselves. So we take them out, get proof of what Los Extranjeros are doing, then blow the lid off this whole damn mess. And find the prep team, if they're still alive. Look, I can start updating your map with intel sites immediately. Just say the word. All right. You're in. Get to work. <laughs> Muy bueno. Gracias por tu ayuda. Hey, great timing. What have you got for us? That last piece of intel you secured, it got me a line on something. We've got enough on the board to move on a new target. Give me the high points. Major Luis Rocha. 
former Argentine army turned independent mercenary contractor. He's commanding operations in one of the local regions. Los Estranjeros sent him in to rebuild the drug labs left behind after the Santa Blanca cartel collapsed. He's already got them up and running, ready for a new coke pipeline. That's fast work. Rocha's been using the locals for slave labor, working them to death and holding their families hostage. He's a real piece of work. His men call him La Machina, the machine. Rocha's as ruthless as they come, and he's ice cold all the way to the core. But we'll warm things up. Send the locations to my map. I'm on it. Oh, good. You made it. Your message said you have something. Oh, yeah. That data you recovered is gold. We have enough to cause a serious dent in the Los Estranjeros operations throughout Villa Verde. Who's the man in charge? The CO is Captain Dante Cruzar. Now, from what we know about him, he's ambitious and he's got a nasty streak a mile wide. Now, the Bolivians are pretty serious about their religious beliefs, but that hasn't stopped them from desecrating churches and imprisoning priests. He's got the locals seriously riled up, and we could take advantage of that. We get them on our side, they can help us take down Cruzar. Consider this a heart and minds up. Rally the locals, and we break Cruzar's hold on the region. Sounds like a plan. How'd that intel work out? You have a new target for us? Copy that. Looks like we've got a situation. One of the Los Estranjeros officers is recruiting Santa Blanca enforcers, and he's carved himself out a nice little kingdom down there. What do we know about him? Captain Tomas Ortiga. Rumors say he was a bare-knuckle street fighter in Guatemala before he became a merc. This guy's a real thug. Likes to taste the blood, likes to gamble. And get this, he set up some kind of arena in the jungle running deathmatch bouts for fun and signing up anyone tough enough to survive. Yeah, I know the type. Men like Ortega have a short fuse. We break some of his toys, call him out, Reckon we might be able to blindside him. Hopefully neutralize whatever remnants of the Santa Blanca are left into the bargain. Update the map. Let's see if we can get Ortega's attention. Good to know you're still alive. We've been trying to regain contact ever since your Hilo went missing. I'm glad to see you haven't been taking a vacation down there. But your actions have had unforeseen consequences. Terminating Cruzar, Ortega, and Rocha has forced Los Estroneros to recall their most senior officer from the Bolivian capital. This nasty son of a bitch is one Colonel Juan Ignacio Merlo, and I guarantee you have rarely encountered a man of such loathsome reputation. Merlo is a known war criminal and the veteran of a dozen bloody brushfire wars, but without him, Los Estroneros will fall apart. We've learned he's planning to make an example of the local civilians as payback for all the chaos you've been causing. As of now, your order is to locate the colonel and terminate his command with extreme prejudice. Ghost Actual, do you copy? Target has been neutralized. Ghost Actual confirms. Good work. All call signs hold station. Extract is incoming, over. So we just cut off the head of the snake and now we walk away? Not our call. Now the people get to choose what happens next. Something tells me every politician who looked the other way is going to have a lot of angry folks coming after them. Hey, that's democracy at work. If you want to keep it, you have to fight for it. News of unrest in the Bolivian capital is reaching us. Reports of a political scandal involving a private military contractor. The group, known as Los Extranjeros, is being investigated for multiple violations of United Nations human rights statutes. Debido a los últimos eventos, el presidente de Bolivia le pide a la población que guarde la calma. A call for free elections to sweep away corruption in the government. A chance for freedom? A new dawn for this beleaguered former narco state? But rumors of U.S. military involvement in Bolivian liberation still remain unconfirmed at this time. <laughs>